Hi, I am Dr. Manjusha Patel and I am the emergency medicine physician. Joint dislocations are not very common, but the only two common dislocations that we see in dislocations are shoulder dislocations in adults and in pediatric population is the elbow dislocation as we certainly and commonly call it as pulled elbow. How these dislocations are treated? First is close reduction. There are certain maneuvers that an orthopedician or we as emergency medicine physicians apply on the patients to help get the bone back into its original position. These are non-surgical treatments. Once this is done, we immobilize the joint because we do not want further and repeated movements at that particular joint. Third aspect of the treatment is surgery. Now, surgeries are advised usually when there are repeated attempts made for close reduction and the dislocation is not put back in place or it is not achieved. Now, these may also involve adjacent bone fractures and hence they are subjected to further um, CT scans. Let's move on to the next one that is the rehabilitation exercises. Now, these exercises include physiotherapy exercises to restore the strength of the muscles. Some points to be noted to be taken care at home. First is rest. This is the most important factor that will help further healing of these dislocated joints. Second, avoid repeated motion, movements or actions. Third, apply ice for the first two, one or two days. What ice does is gives an analgesia effect. How do we apply ice? Use cold, uh, cold ice packs. Apply them for 15 to 20 minutes at a particular time and you can repeat them at the most 2 to 3 times per day. Third day onwards, you can use hot fermentation bags. Now, hot fermentation helps in reducing the contraction of the muscles at that particular joint. Last but not the least, maintain a good analgesic cover. By that, your orthopedic will advise you certain analgesic medications to keep your pain at minimal and also some anti-inflammatory agents to reduce the swelling at that particular joint. Thank you.